What is up guys? My name is Marco and today I want to talk about a new fragrance that is not so new but it came out recently. It's the new fragrance from Paco Rabanne. It's called Pure Excess. This is the fragrance. I think it's supposed to be a lighter. Paco Rabanne Pure Excess. It's supposed to be a lighter, the cap and the bottle. What about the fragrance? Well, I was in Miami when I first tried it, when it first came out here in Europe. It came out a little bit later. Uh, I tried it in the airport and it didn't surprise me that much. I was expecting maybe too much from that fragrance. But after came out, after came back here to Italy, I tried it again a couple of times and it was every time better and better so after trying it and trying it and trying to make it smell to other people and try the performance the scent how people complimented me i decided okay it's christmas i'm gonna make i'm gonna ask somebody to give me that as a gift and it happened so now i have it i mean it's an amazing creation by the brand paco rabanne and but I didn't understand the purpose of that fragrance as soon as it came out. It's a little bit a controversial topic because it's a sweet fragrance, but it has contrast inside. For example, like, like vanilla and smokiness, fresh and spicy notes at the same time. I mean, guys, I think It's a fragrance meant to be seductive. It's a fragrance like... It's not an attention grabber like Dior Sauvage or Paco Rabanne One Million or Invictus. It's not li like that fragrance that you smell it and you turn your head around to see who is smelling like that. It's more private, but it's something that is meant to be seductive in a way that you don't grab people's attention, but if somebody is close to you, for example, somebody that you love, a lover or a girl that you're flirting with, uh, this fragrance invites her or him, her in this case, because it's a male fragrance, it, it is supposed to be a male fragrance, to get even closer and sleep with you. This is what I think. So now, like all the fragrances that I rate, I'm gonna rate it for the scent, the performance, and the compliments. Well, what about the scent? It smells, it's very hard to explain. It's sweet, but it's fresh and spicy at the same time. I think it smells like a very sexy and masculine Coca-Cola with ice and spices. <laughs> Is it understandable what I said? I don't know, but it's it's a very bad explanation, but it's pretty accurate, I mean, I think. I really enjoy the scent. I didn't at first, but now I just can't stop smelling it. It's so good. I rate it an 8.5 out of 10. What about the performance? This is not the best performance ever, ever created. Um, yeah, you can smell it and it's not so bad in terms of longevity, but for example, if you wear it on in the club or in winter time, maybe you're outside, it's very hard that people um, smell your friends. You have to be very close to him, hug him or maybe say hi to him. Uh, I think this creates a bubble, a private bubble for people that are very close to you. It's meant to be a seductive. I think this is a sex fragrance. I think this is meant to be like a fragrance that you use when you have sex with the girls. <laughs> That's simply it. That's simple. The, the, the thoughts that I had all the time. And for that, I think I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. This is not a very good sillage and this is not a very good performance, but for the reason that is created, I think it's perfect. What about the compliments? Well, it's very strange also in this category because it's not a basic, it's, it's not a um, common fragrance. Uh, I didn't receive so many compliments for that, not so many, but 
when I made smell this fragrance, some girls loved it and some girls was like, mm. it's like, I don't know, but you saw that uh, they had a reaction in their mind. They had something like, mm. it's like a cool guy that knows he's very good looking, he's very cool, and girls know it, but they don't want him to know that they know it. Is it understandable? Like, I don't know, did you see the spot? There's a very cool spot, check it out on YouTube, of this fragrance. That guy knows he's very sexy, knows he's very, it's the best looking guy ever. And girls know it. But girls, you know, they don't want you to know that you are the best good looking guy in the world. So they act like, hmm, okay. But in their mind, they think that you are. I think that this is, this is what I think about compliments. This is like exactly the guy, the model in the spot in television about this fragrance. I rated an eight, a, eight out of 10, eight. Yeah, eight. So that's it guys. This is my review for this fragrance. I personally enjoy it. Why? Because it's not a common fragrance. I use it when I want to be a little bit more sexy, a little bit. I don't know if I have to uh, go with girls. I don't know, try to spice it up a little bit. This is what I think. <laughs> this is Paco Rabanne, pure excess. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up subscribe and I'll see you next week. Peace.